China has crossed a major threshold in modern air combat, with the maiden flight of its revolutionary Zhu Tian unmanned aerial platform, an aircraft many analysts are already calling the world's first true airborne drone carrier. This successful test flight represents far more than a technological milestone. It signals a fundamental shift in how future wars may be fought in the skies. First unveiled at the Zhuhai Air Show in late 2024, the Jutian has now moved from concept to reality. With this flight, China becomes the first nation to bring an entirely new class of military aircraft closer to operational status. One designed not to fight alone, but to command entire drone swarms from the air. Built for long-range and high-endurance missions, Jutian is reported to have a range exceeding 8,000 kilometers and an operational ceiling of around 15,000 meters. These characteristics allow it to operate far beyond the reach of most manned aircraft. What truly sets it apart, however, is its unprecedented payload concept. The ability to carry, deploy, and coordinate up to 100 smaller drones while airborne. These drones can be released mid-mission in coordinated swarms, conducting reconnaissance, electronic warfare, precision strikes, and saturation attacks. The Jiutian itself can also carry long-range precision weapons, including cruise missile class munitions, enabling it to function both as a drone launch platform and a strategic strike asset. Military experts often compare Jiutian to a flying aircraft carrier, but unlike naval carriers, this airborne mothership releases autonomous systems from high altitude, giving them extended range, speed, and survivability. At present, no other nation is known to field a directly comparable system. The importance of this first flight lies in what it confirms. Stable aerodynamics, reliable propulsion, and the ability to carry heavy payloads, reportedly up to five tons, including a modular drone deployment system. That system is believed to be capable of dispersing large numbers of loitering munitions across wide areas, overwhelming enemy air defenses. This development comes as drone warfare reshapes conflicts worldwide. The Jutian does not merely participate in this evolution, it enables it at an entirely new scale, with a single aircraft acting as a command hub for a vast autonomous force. For decades, the idea of a flying aircraft carrier remained theoretical. Advances in materials, sensors, propulsion, and artificial intelligence have finally made it viable, and China may be the first to prove it in practice. With its first successful flight now complete, the Jutian marks the beginning of a new era in air warfare, one where the sky itself becomes an autonomous battlefield.